Balum, balum, balum. Balum, balum, balum. Nada, nada. Bye, 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 bye. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, I'm a flat. Nothing on. Uh, outside, outside, on the pin, on the Rotation, rotation, rotation. Dead yan sa rotation. Nasa bathroom na. Uh, bathroom, bathroom, bathroom. Pinulum, pinulum. 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 Nice, yeah, nice, 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 Drone has located a bomb. Oi, basement, is it? Sana pa din na kubog yung cross eh. Shotgun go live. You must recover the diffuser. Time to make a new door. May nagti-tricking. Lepag granada nga din. Sige ba. Nagti-tricking. Loading back. Deb. Thank you for Jaeger, the down yun sir Nung pot yun sir Di na siya Down yun sir Nung pot yun Push, 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 push. Low low you mean. Pen, 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 pen. Where is the bomb? 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 Nice, 
sorry, I'm loud. <laughs> oh, sa tears pa naman. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a put to <laughs> Okay, okay. Too pushy, too pushy. Who's at this? Where you from, bro? From, bro? I'm from Thailand. Uh, I'm Ooh. learning to speak. Nice, 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 very, nice. very nice. Uh, then. How about you? Oh, I'm oh, from I'm the from Philippines, Philippines, bro. Ah, oh, Philippines, okay. Pinoy pra, pinoy pra. Secure the bombs. Oh, nice oh, one. Nice one. Pinoy pra, pinoy pra. Dapat kung ito yung mga kalaban natin, hindi mo na pinapayalaban tayo. Op 4 has located a bomb. Get ready to engage. Setting up. Time for destruction. Stay clear of ADS line of fire. Grabe ka naman Add natin si Openmeister At least ito kami siya Pato Pinabasag na Wala, hindi ko nasira yung isa. Hindi ko kita. Mm, dito. Meron dito. Be careful. Udo. Uh, Udo. Barum. Ace ba yun, George? Ah. Uh. Yeah. Udo. Udo. Big window. Floyd, we have some time. Try go around. Okay. The Kiba barrier is empty. Ano na, nag-tamer eh. Puta, hindi yung nag-trigger. Ang bilis naman mag-trigger nung claymor. Oh! Ang duga. Nandiyan pa din. Last window, maybe? Yeah. Nice, Warrior. Hostiles eliminated. <laughs> Nishi, it's a good one, man. Uy. Hindi yan, ba't may ganyan? Ayun na, isa kang prototype, ah. Ano yan, ganin yan. Yan. Sobrang dami nating talo, nagkanta na yung parang <laughs> Ay, sis! Ay, wala ka pala Ay, parang Ano ka po man? So, magkaroon lab? Ah, uh, gusto mo ato magkaroon ng web application pa yun. Ano to?
Uy. Eh, hindi. Add ko. Si Open Meister. Tarot natin ng XP. Putang ina. Uy, let's go. Pag-alit ah, mag-add dito sa Ubisoft. Tangatangan sa Ubisoft. Ano well, spelling ng pangalan niya? Narin alam eh. Ah, uh, check ko. Paano mo ito yun? Hindi ko alam na ito eh. Hindi ko makita eh. The suggestions. Mga friends in common lang ito. Kikig na lang ako. Uy, Capcan. Naman. Naman dapat. A bomb must be located. Uy, may run out, sir. Eddie, iping natin siya. Uy, meron sa baba. Puta na liligaw na ako Pukok ako ng flashbang eh Kanan mo Arp Ay sa likod sa baba Hindi ko narinig All friendlies have been eliminated. Is she not a ultra wide monitor? Left. Same thing. Did you get it?
Your drone has located a bomb. <laughs> Ten seconds to go. Penthouse are the open. Five seconds. You found a bomb. Make your way to its location and defuse it. Kakap kan saya tapi ko. I'm out. Gotta reload. Ento, ento di to. Pagi ento. Oh ma, malis. Ento di ne di ne drone. Malis eh. Cukup. Ento, to, to, to. Sepak pasok lang. Pelasan yang bombo. Tayo mo? Sundan mo nga yung image ko left Yung ilo ko Ayun, sa kanan Saan yung lesion trap left? Si Dengo G pala yun eh Kalaban natin yung kanin eh Ay talaga ba? Oo, sorry Kaya na kami check yun Wap talaga si Dengo G Iba na siya Kitchen na sila. Tong oh, ina, grabe naman to. Five seconds to insertion. The drone has found a bomb. You've located oh, a bomb. Make your way to its location and defuse it. Oi, grab in the man. Oi, grab in the man. Oi, grab in the man. Magalit ka. Magalit ka buwan. Nagsasara eh. Ay puta yun na 
abangan ako dun sa service entrance Uy, Dev, pwede ka naman. Communist Revolution and was picked to then lead the communist part of Korea. Kim wanted to unite the peninsula under communism with force. But he couldn't do that without the blessing of his Soviet supporters. Mainly this guy, Joseph Stalin. And this is where the evidence we found gets pretty juicy. Among communists, Kim is the last to maintain a personality cult. Located a bomb. Be ready for assault. Ten seconds to insertion. Building new magazine. Five seconds and counting. Prepping needles. Op four has located a bomb. Be ready for hostile action. Camera ready to activate. Uy, saan yan, Dev? Barrier placed. We're covered. Oo, sa may penthouse yun. Oo, sir, penthouse yun. Yung headshot yun. Uh, Check these out. These are telegrams and conversations between Joseph Stalin and Kim Il Sung. I mean, this is like the best. When you are looking at original conversations in the original text from these great leaders, which have since been declassified by the presidential archives in Moscow, you learn more from this than you do from any textbook or any master's degree. Because this is like the horse's mouth. This is what they were actually saying. You start to get the first insights into how the Cold War would start to play out. The logic, the calculations, the fears, the goals. Okay, so it's 1949. Kim Il-sung immediately goes to Stalin, asking for support and weapons to invade the South to unite the peninsula under the communist flag. Not surprisingly, Stalin is very interested in communism winning out on the Korean peninsula. But you read these conversations, and you see that he's also kind of freaked out. The Americans are there, and a direct conflict with these two superpowers is a recipe for another global war. Plus, China, which is another communist ally, is currently in a big civil war. They're not going to be able to help Kim out in his efforts. So Stalin basically says no. But then the next year, 1950, three big things change. Stalin sends a note to Kim saying he's quote ready to help him in this matter. Tell them to come to Moscow. Parang sa Seoul, you know. Uy. Ang nipis. Thing number one. 
Stalin got intel from one of his spies in Washington that South Korea wasn't that important to the I need them. Share the camera. Oh, oh, yeah. Hmm. Ah. Secure the area. Keep the bombs protected. Hindi. Oh, boss. Boss promise ka lang ba? Bomb location has been compromised. Zuriyas online. Natutuwa ako to ang atong di ba ay natutuwa sa mama. Natutuwa nga ako sa kanya. Sakto lang. Stay clear of blast zone. Eh, ito na naman ah. Oh. Sarap ito ko to. Mama, do you lost it? Nice one. Oh, grab me. Reloading ammo. Meron sa armory. Sa kabilang pader. Kabilang side ng side. Ang lakas nyo naman. Uy, ang lakas nyo ha. Uy, naman si Versatile.gg. Uy. The Americans. And if there was an invasion, the Americans probably wouldn't do anything. US troops were leaving the peninsula. Thing number two, and this is a big freaking deal. Stalin says it right here. That, quote, the USSR now has the atomic bomb. Ending the US's atomic monopoly. That changes everything. And thing number three, and again, we see this in another conversation, Stalin says to Kim in one of these meetings, the communists in China had just won their civil war. Ooh. They control China now. They're not busy with the civil war and they'll be able Shower to help with dope. an invasion of South Korea. With these three major developments, yeah. Stalin now yeah, feels nah, nah, secure nah. that the US won't come to, quote, Ooh. challenge the communists in Asia. Well, it would be know, an bro. easy victory. Yeah. Oh, and at the end of all these conversations, Stalin is like, side note, we will support you, we will give you weapons, but we're not going to send troops. Go out. Ligo rin alam lab eh. Kung alam ko eh, di... Sinabi ko na sa'yo lab. Ligo rin alam lab eh. 
Sei isso é uma bomba. Down to five seconds. Setting up Vulcan. Op 4 has located a bomb. Bomb de bomb de bomb. Changing mag. Oi, 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 the mind, the mind's up, please. Go ask Mal for those, which is exactly what he did. So do you see what's happening here? This is like Cold War, like crash course. It is spies. The prevailing mood is not to there. interfere in the US. It is global ideological alliances. The Chinese victory is all. Mm -mm. Also important psychologically. And it is nuclear deterrence. The USSR now has the atomic bomb. The seeds of the Cold War are sprouting. After three years of preparation, the Soviet Union and its North Korean puppets were ready. Troops and military equipment poured down from the north. So then, early one morning in June of 1950, it happened. Some 75,000 soldiers from the north blast across this line. A line that two American military guys had drawn five years earlier. June 25th, 1950, the communist strike. And as Kim Il-sung predicted, his troops quickly took over nearly the entire peninsula. But Stalin's calculation was wrong. Back in Washington, Can you open President the hatch, Truman bro? wasn't going to let the communists take over the Korean peninsula. The future of civilization depends on what we do on what we do now. He got ready for war, bypassing Congress to prepare to get a bunch of UN nations together uh -oh. to come to Korea's rescue. Despite obstacles, United Nations forces drive on to the 38th parallel border of North Korea. Well, uh, the details of what happened so next are astounding. And frankly, I have no idea why I didn't learn these details in school. This was a brutal and long war, incredibly destructive. The entire peninsula was ripped apart. But an important detail for this story is what the U.S. Air Force did up here in the north. The versatility of air forces was proved as never before. With their new jet-powered aircraft, they quickly established air superiority and dropped an unfathomable amount of explosives onto North Korea. Like, it's hard to quantify, but to put it into perspective, the U.S. Air Force dropped more bombs on North Korea in this three-year period than they did during the entire Pacific theater of World War II. After identifying their targets, our planes swooped down like avenging shadows of death and destruction. The U.S. Air Force targeted basically anything that moved. Villages, towns, buildings, factories, and very importantly, dams. U.S. carrier-based planes take off. Their target, the vital hydroelectric power plants south of the Yalu River. Unleashing a flood of water that washed away villages and killed the water supply to rice and other crops, leading to an excruciatingly slow starvation of the people who started living in a network of underground caves to escape the bombardment of their country. An advance oh, purpose, the... General Ridgeway State. Insertion in 10 seconds. Five seconds. Located a bomb. Make your way to its location and defuse it. Setting a recon drone. I found the rabbit. Troy, you think, bro? Isa na din sa ano office. Isa na sa office. Puta. Chinuing lang ako. Four last 
last operator standing. You have dropped the teaser. Friendly, last operator standing. Asa na dyan? Alam ko. Ang dugi ako dito. Wala na ako ka John John, sir. My bad. Is not to seize ground, but to wipe out the enemy. In the end, 85% of all buildings in North Korea were destroyed. 85%. The communists had finally launched their undeclared all-out war of conquest. Now wait, I know what you're thinking if you're familiar with this conflict, which is that this entire peninsula Ooh, got slammed. What is the north? Good. The north and the south. What's Seoul was turned to dust as well. This was a horrifying war. Oh, or the reason I'm highlighting the utter destruction and the aerial bombardment of the North is because what the U.S. Air Force did here, this, this memory, became a foundational memory for these people. It would go on to inform the rest of the country's history to this day. This memory would not fade. Noise. Uy, nasa ulit Oo, yung ito to to Oo, oh, 90 Nasa uh, ano, office na, office 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 ng hook, ng Yan, lapit sa fountain Nice Grab Binato ng flash para magbigay ng in <laughs> This horrific war went on for three years, until 1953, when they signed a ceasefire, freezing the front line of the war where it was on the day they signed. Right here. The agreement was to take this line and put a two-kilometer buffer on each side, declaring it a zone where no military activity can occur. A demilitarized zone. 
gusto ko naman magsabihin ko. So where I'm standing now is the demilitarized zone, the DMZ. No military stuff allowed within this four kilometer thick buffer zone. Up here, North Korea, down here, South Korea. And these borders are some of the most fortified and militarized lines on our planet. After the war, the American military never went home. And since then, there have been tens of thousands of troops on this peninsula. Oh, and crucially, the U.S. stored nuclear weapons on this peninsula during the Cold War, providing South Korea with the security they needed to turn into a thriving, advanced democracy, helping them build their country to move on from the trauma and pain of this war. And like I said earlier, North Korea did the opposite. They didn't move on. They stayed fixated on what happened during those three years of horror, continuing to build up anti-aircraft defenses, underground bunkers and tunnels, and over the course of decades, their Soviet supporters... supporters First block. Okay, it's a penthouse. Uh -huh. Dami namang depot come dito Target sa bar. Probably the logo si versatile Dutch. Getting a warning. Oh, palayan, well. Camera dito. Oh, you're not on the tool. So, kung naman yung pag si lip niya. Meron? Baya yung vision, Zeb. Ito, Frost, oh. Nasa pink pipe. Mas may Capcom, Capcom, may Capcom dito. Ito, Frost. Patay na yung Frost. May Capcom trap sa pin 2 yards, ah. Ah. Kaya. Kapag kontapol sa pinto, dalawa. Reload. Ay po, tayo na mo. Sa may labas. Nasa ano penthouse ato. Yes, sila kung dumbo ba? Bend ba? Bend ba? In pen, in pen, in pen, in pen, NBA, NBA. De Juji na naman. Helped them learn the science of nuclear energy that by 2006 turned into nuclear weapons. North Korea becoming the eighth country to possess the most destructive weapons in the world. And as the Soviet Union collapsed and cut off all of its support, North Korea used this one weapon to stay in the conversation. To ensure that they would never find themselves in this situation again. <laughs> As one historian from Columbia University said, North Korea never forgot the lessons of their vulnerability from American airstrikes, and that the long-term psychological effects of the war on the whole of North Korean society cannot be overestimated. The war against the United States, more than any other single factor, gave North Koreans a collective sense of anxiety and fear of outside threats that would continue long after the war's end. North Korea keeps this memory alive Oy, through horrific the imagery. There's actually a museum just south of Pyongyang that's dedicated to the atrocities committed by the United States. You walk into this place and it is full of horrific imagery, like paintings of Americans doing terrible things to North Koreans. I'm not gonna show you any of this propaganda here because it is gruesome and horrifying. Oh, and the target audience of this museum 
children. Every year, young children make a pilgrimage to this museum to witness these images and affirm in their minds their hatred for the United States and their desire for revenge, keeping alive this memory from the 1950s. The regime keeps this memory alive to keep their people scared and oppressed, constantly ready for war. Back in Seoul, every few years, North Korea comes out and says that they are ready and willing to turn this city into a sea of fire or a pile of ashes. And frankly, they have the tools to do it. Up here on this border, there are over 10,000 big military guns pointed at this city. These guns have a range of over 60 kilometers, which puts Seoul very much in range. Luckily, people in this city are ready. There are over 3,000 bomb shelters sprinkled throughout Seoul, and that is what I'm looking for today. Luckily, the government made an app to show the people of Seoul where all of these bomb shelters are. Wait, this is the bomb shelter? I mean, I guess we're underground, but like, barely. Gotta talk to one of these shop owners, see what they think. Did you know that this was a bomb shelter? I guess is the question. That one was just a shopping mall. Come on, let's go somewhere else on the map. Wait, so the next bomb shelter on this map is a Starbucks. What? So did you know that there's a bomb shelter? Uh, I didn't know that. I've never thing? noticed that. Um, so this is it. This is the bomb shelter. The basement of this apartment complex. Um, let's go f visit another one, I guess. We've reached another shelter. Now I'm really in a bomb shelter. Oh, actually, it's just another parking garage. What is this? I mean, it's just like if we had to rush down here, is there water? Is there extra food? Is there some way to seal it off so that chemical weapons don't get down here? No, it's literally an unchanged parking garage. Not retrofitted, not special in any way. <sighs> I'm starting to lose faith in the idea that these bomb shelters are anything but just normal city infrastructure that have signs on them that say these are bomb shelters. Do these people not realize they live 40 kilometers from North Korea? What I'm, I'm making a video about sort of the American perspective okay. of North Korea, <laughs> which is like, yeah. have you ever thought through like a scenario of like what you would do in case of an attack? Oh, uh... no. You don't. I've actually never thought about it. <laughs> no. <laughs> We just hate the regime and oh my god! <laughs> I can't do this! I hate pigeons so much. <laughs> yes. Are you more afraid of pigeons than Yeah. Korea? <laughs> Where, Where were we? About... <laughs> Salam, you And you know, as I told you, I've lived here for my whole life and I've seen them like, testing nuclear weapons and you know, but like we don't really care and... Now listen, let me just be frank. I'm slightly playing up my ignorance here. I kind of knew that this was the case, but I also kind of didn't. As an American who studied this conflict through...
Oh, isang piano, yes, I'll play. Doon sa piano, Jones. Nasa... Dito lang, sa may Christmas tree na side. You have dropped the defuser. A cigar? Oh, it's not a cigar. Mm -mm, okay. Ay, puta, nandun pala sa baba nung hatch. Pag baba mo, Lev, nasa likod mo. Pag baba mo. Ay, shit. Ayun, malis na dun. <laughs> Ikaw pala nag-down sa akin, Lep. Sa pace, sa pace naman meron. Ayun na, nakalipat na, sir. Come on. Baka naman madami pa kami sa reputation. Puta. Okay naman, iinit yun oh. So nagang... <laughs> Gusto niyang pumatay Through ng tao. American foreign policy lens, my hunt for bomb shelters and the subsequent conversations with locals drove home just how little the people here actually think about Di North Korea. Point, I don't know. think I've ever met anyone in Korea who was like really worried about that. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Kim Jong-un doesn't do this to threaten South Korea. They do this to threaten us, the United States, the military that turned their country into dust in the 1950s, the country that they are technically still at war with. Back up here at the border, you can see what the conflict actually looks like today between North and South. There's occasional violence, but the conflict today is often more petty. Who can build the largest flagpole? Who can blast the loudest music at each other? North Korea comically building a fake city to look more prosperous, and a competition of who can look the scariest. You realize that it's not actually scary or threatening to be here. If anything, it's just plain sad. It's sad to see 70 years of this standoff, this needless standoff that was created by powerful outsiders. And once again, what we see is that the people who share the same history and culture and language but are divided, continue to be the ones that suffer from this. Be advised your drone has located bomb. Insertion in five seconds. After my proceed to bomb location and defuse it. Son. Saan, Lev? Loading new mag! Eh, pinanik na ako, Lev, eh. 
Duvarı mı ne yoklaştı? Nice. Bir sen abi bunu gördün sen kentler. Napada. Tá só preso. Oh, só preso aí, isso. Não posso parar aí, as. Para me comer a luz custa essa brisa. What the fuck? My time in the DMZ, I decided to set aside the history, the bluster, the fear, just for a moment, to experience this place not as an American. Hanggang tuon na lang sila. Oh yeah. To see this region purely in terms of conflict. But to experience it as the people here experience it. The people here in this city that is unrecognizable from the devastation of the 50s. A city that has moved on. It is a Saturday night here in Seoul, South Korea. The sun is going down. You seen that? I spent the night traversing this city, immersing myself in what it has to offer. From the nightclubs to barbecue to small underground clubs watching DJ competitions and sipping soju. Then to a street party in the middle of the night where a bunch of young people are protesting the forced eviction and planned demolition of this historic pub. One of Seoul's oldest institutions for beer and dried fish. They've been doing this every night for months. Yes, North Korea is 40 kilometers away. I'm very aware of that. There's a real threat here. A dangerous, oppressive regime. Eh, dito na lang sa nakita natin na malaki. Sorry, Kino. Let's go! Whoa, puto. Dalawa third floor. Dalawa third floor na sa bar. Ano yan? Okay. Ito yung close yun. Ito, ay nabindebate daw ng close. Sabi naman yun Puta patay na ako Patay ko well, paalam well Nag-claimor ako eh You fucking muppet! What are you doing? Abuse! What's in here? I'm reading cluster charge. One friendly operator remaining. Lev, you want to do it, Lev? I believe in you. Lev, I believe in you, Lev. That's a red yet. 
now secured. Fifteen seconds left. Then, then, then. Ten seconds remaining. I believe in your left. is online and active. Left. Left. Four eliminated. Tidak ada yang cross, ya? Grave, grave. Wuih, ini teman tu PUBG ya. Macam nak gua bantu cik teman tu PUBG. Eh, parang semua gitu. with powerful weapons, but the threat presents very differently for the people here, much differently than the fear that we feel an ocean away. I walked away from Korea with... I'm gonna make an adjudge. Ah, you can. Down to top eh Didili din muna Wala na yung sniper mode eh Kung practice, sniper mode Bomb located by Op 4 Para bab kesa ini, para bab kesa ini. Kini ini. Pakai tangan saya, pak. Eh. Lep, pakai tangan saya, lep. Ih, kita, kita di sini, kita di sini. Ih, dok aku, dok. One out four remaining. Oh, pahil naman den. Asa, asa, asa. Oh, you went fifteen. Ready for company. Oh, you look up at all your clothes. You went up on the With a much clearer understanding of this conflict, this conflict that was started by North Korea, fueled by Cold War dynamics, and remains an active set up war between North Korea and the United States of America. Thank you for watching this video. I'm really bombs.
Isa lang. Ten seconds remaining. Walang yun Bomb location secure. Device prime. Keep an eye on two. EDD prime. Stand clear. Grabe naman ang lupet. Grabe naman yung cab. Super interrogator. Lev, if I do yan, Lev, saka. I can hit you, I can hit you and your friends. Cab, I hit you. Cab, I hit you, Cab. Come, Come to me. To me. Healing for everyone. Meron na site ah. Ping 1, ping 1. Bakery. Ano ba bakery? Eh may, may happy new year dito. Oo, uh, may ED din. <laughs> Op 4 located a bomb. Protect it. Bakery, ayan na isa pa. May kasunod yung mountain. Isa na kay Cub Nawala Wala wala Dito pa rin Small bakery Small bakery Go Cub Go Cub Uy wag Go behind 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 Uy Nagbaba na shield Oh Grabe Pinahantin kasi nakahantin Wala Grabe lang naman dito isa ka palang mag-clear na tao hindi, alam mo naman yung kagalingan mo na gano'n yung ginawa mo looking forward to your thoughts and sarap mag-dock ah plus 50 points per heal isa pa nga sarap healing for everyone para ako si Mercy Natry mo na yung, ano, Apex Guards. Hindi. Oh, Enjoy your spot. Tutorial lang. Protected. Don't wait. 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 Eh, hindi na load ko ng Overwatch kasi wala ako. Uy, pwede naman din. Sino may sakit pa ako? Meron, meron din. Puri na patay. Pinamaan ko, putang ina. Papuntang bakery. Parang third door sila magagali.
Do you live Bro, go from the to the the What the fuck? Did I shut the Sa labas, dito. Ting pa. Sa labas lang ng side. Meron na akong technique din. Eh. Which is called run out. Super run out na. Super run out god. Loading new mag. Mission critical bomb diffuser active. Are located. Disable it. Oh, okay, no, One friendly operator remaining. Sina. Bot in on the lab. Op four. Last That's all way in the lab. Boom. No. Nice. Oh, my lamp. <laughs> Bakit naman? Hindi ko naman lipat tayo mo pa. Uy! Tap na niyo ang katawa niya. Body How do I describe you? Uh, Britain's leading expert on coffee? Or Britain's leading YouTuber on coffee? Or... Ah, coffee expert. Good job. Good So you're asking me what I do for a living. I'm like, I don't know. Things. Yeah, I know the feeling. I mean, it's a YouTube. It's a YouTube. Yeah. Right. Just so we say coffee person, YouTube weirdo. Uh, right. Okay. I don't know. I don't know. If you don't mind, I'll someone else do. I'm with James Hoffman, who has just asked me to call him YouTube coffee weirdo, so... That's probably accurate. <laughs> his words, not mine. Who's going to teach me about coffee, which is something I know... I, I, it's not that I don't know anything about coffee. It's that I haven't really yeah. tasted coffee since I was a kid. Okay. Now, that was the... Well, that was the setup that was initially interesting. Like, right? find your perfect coffee. Yeah. yeah and then there were, like, a couple of caveats. <laughs> you don't like coffee. And, and sort of not a huge fan of caffeine. So I, I decided when I was sort of 14, 15 that I did not like coffee because I tried coffee and I probably tried, I don't think it was instant, but I think it was, it was fairly cheap drip coffee or something okay. like that. I just said, well, I don't, I do not Ooh. understand why the adults like this. I'm not going to do it. And then I kind of never really got into caffeine. I decided that wasn't for me either. So it was just, it was just easier to say I don't like coffee. But like socially, it's nice to be able to accept a cup of coffee yeah. It's a thing that clearly a lot of people really enjoy. Yeah. So I'm like, I want to reevaluate this. I want to, I want to be able to say, I want to be able to make the decision, is this a thing that adult me in my 30s actually likes? And I think if anyone's going to be able to find me something that is not cheap drip coffee. I would hope so. Yes. So, so I worked on the idea that, that Caffeine was mostly out. So 90% of what you're going to taste today does not have caffeine in it, yeah. which made it a challenge. Yeah, yeah and it will have done. Because I know that's, that's a, because decaffeinating things, I looked into the process, it's a big deal. It's a big deal. Um, oh, I'm okay with needs. having, a, like if there's a bit of caffeine in there, I'm fine with that. Like if there's more, if I drink more than about one shot of espresso through the course of this though, it's probably going to, that's, well, we'll see how we go. <laughs> we'll see what happens. So what we're going to do today, okay. We're going to do a little guided tasting, right? Because okay. I'll tell you why afterwards. Uh, we're going to start with with one round to, to assess kind of one aspect of coffee to see how you feel about it. So we've got in front of us three coffees. Okay. 
I'm not going to tell you what they are because it's not important. We're, we're going we're to do a sort of a, a base preference test around coffee. Okay. Um, so what I'm going to do is, is do these as what we would call a cupping, which is the very simple way we taste coffee. There's ground coffee in each glass. I'm going to pour boiling water on top. Yep. They're going to hang out for about four minutes. Okay. Give them a little stir, scoop off the stuff that floats, and then that liquid we can taste. Right. Before I put water on these, just yep. for your interest, mm -hmm. have a smell of each glass. Okay. Uh, and just see how you feel. The smell of coffee to most people is quite nice. Yes, I'd absolutely. be interested to know if one of these smells nicer to, the, to you right. than another. Okay. And uh, I'm going to go and boil a kettle. Okay. Okay, so number one. Okay, so that... I don't have the words for it, but that's, that's, sort of le that's, that's not a pleasant... That feels like there's a lot, of, a lot of kind of earth, wood notes, things like that. I don't... I, I don't have the words to describe what that is, but the, the word that came to mind was sort of uh, earth. Uh, number two. Oh, my mute. Wood. If, if, if number one is earth, number two is wood. Uh, oh, number three is a lot nicer. Number three is... Number three almost has a sweet note on top of it. <laughs> Oh. oh yeah, wood, earth, wood, slightly sweeter, but I don't know what to call it. So nice. that, it's just quite nice if you yeah. like the smell. That smell pleasant to you, yeah. right? So, boiling water into each of them. So these are... Time for a wake-up call. Hey, but I'm Billy's. Oh no, I didn't know what to do. Uh, freshly ground. Freshly ground. Right. There's a whole process there, which I know you go into great detail about on your channel. Everything can be optimized. Hot coffee is actually really quite hard to taste. And, and it's a mistake that people plan. kind of make is that, you know, you drink your coffee hot, you want it for the heat, but if you want it for flavor, you won't get the best out of it. And you'll tend to experience things like bitterness a little bit more intensely when it's hot that can fade a little as it cools down and things okay. get just more interesting. And you'll experience that. Keep so I'll tell you now, vehicle. what you think about these when you first taste them will change. Okay. Right, as, as, right. as you go through. Now, when it comes time to what taste, what? what I I don't want to do yeah, is just throw a, a load of flavor and experience at you and be like, how is that? <laughs> yeah. Because that's just too much. The brain's just like, I don't know. <laughs> and you get into a very much like a, I, don't, I like it, I don't, I don't know what it is. I'm just, no. So what we're People gonna do with the taste you. is break down sort of single components and compare them coffee to coffee. Oh, okay. okay. Right, comparative tasting is the single best way to learn to taste anything right, right sitting at home with a glass of wine mm -hmm. trying to work out what does this taste like what what how do i describe this really hard yeah. really hard yeah rotate nila gilid na gilid nung pader tingo tuloy masilip Pag sinilip ko yung rotate nila, expose ako dun sa ano? Sa may long hallway. Yan pala yun. Yan pala dapat. Yan ako eh. Ayun na. Pas pag, in, pag sinilip ko naman yung long hallway, may expose naman ako dun sa rotate. Sa rotate. Yan pala gumawa ng rotate. Gilip na gilip. Tama ka dun, Deb. Ah, so, wala eh. Parang sabi mo, Five, ayaw like tulungan si Jess. You've located a bomb. Make your way to its location and defuse it. One more, 
front, one more guys. One more guys. Oh, tayo na, di ko pa napatay ang mute Uy, muntik na! Puta ko na mo! Di naman siya tinamaan, pero binarit pa rin niya ako. O, sige. Yellow stairs. Meron sa hallway. Down to sa one basement, friendly. sa main lockers. Op 4 eliminated all friendlies. Hey, the the game up a little. Oi, grab the mento. Five seconds to go. Proceed to bomb location and defuse. You know, pag palit ako ng second. Pelan shield on the ground. Patay echo drone. Ola patay ni me echo, patay ni echo. Go plant, go plant, go plant, go plant. Jago, pumasok siya. Meron. Di tama lang yung plant. Bond diffusion initiated. Protect the diffuser. Bakit ka naman sumipik ng may glass? Sa pato, sa pato, sa pato! Titan Dapat pumik ng kanan Dok? Uy, pwede. Sige, heal ko kayo. Uy. 
Gusto nyo na pupuno agad yung buhay nyo, ah. Sige. Bomb location. Pero na papanik na ng stairs. Here they come. Patay na. Hindi eh, pa boy pa. Eh, patay na. Yung stairs na sinasabi mong mate bro. Putain na mo, hindi ko napatay Sa baba, sa may passport and sa may visa and Meron sa baba ng bathrooms Adding overwatch May nagdodraw na dito sa ano, service stairs eh. Uy puta! Ulo ako! Sa so, may ano, break, yung break room. Ewan ko nga sir. You might be like, it's a bit fruity, but oh, that's kind of where you end. Give yourself two glasses, oh, much more fun, uh, but you can compare the two, right? Which one is fruitier, which don't, one is more acidic, don't, which one is sweeter, don't, which don't, one don't, finishes don't, better, don't, all of those kind of things. That's what we're going to do here. Yeah. To start off with, we're just going to focus on single aspects yeah, yeah. of the coffee uh, and compare and contrast those. All right. Okay, I'm just going to clean these up a little bit now. So when you say clean mm. these up? So, if you try to drink this now, oh, yeah. that's just ground so, coffee floating sorry, on top. Okay, let's not do that. Which is, uh, <laughs> it's, I mean, it's... It's, um, it's an experience. It's, it's food safe. <laughs> yes. It's just not, it's just not nice. Uh, so what you do is you give them a little stir. And this actually causes most of the grounds that were floating on the top to sink to the bottom. Mm. Right. And then we scoop off whatever remains. Ah, okay. Leaving behind... Uh, let me throw this in here. I assume that the stuff... So the stuff on top, I feel like, is a thing I've seen in a lot of coffees. Right? Like the, what the, how do you mean, like the foamy stuff? Yeah. Or is that a different, bear in mind, complete novice here. Right, okay. Uh, I'll give you the very short answer, which okay. is foam happens in coffee because it when you roast coffee, uh, a bunch of the byproducts from the chemistry of roasting is CO2. I guess trapped inside oh, of the coffee. Okay. Uh, about a kilo of coffee will produce in its roasting process about 10 liters of CO2 as an outcome. Right. Uh, mm. A lot of that gets trapped in the coffee and certain brew methods 
sort of bring it out. So espresso is the most famous. 1948, a guy invents a high-pressure espresso machine. Yep. Op 4 has located a bomb. Be ready for assault. Auto left. Sorry, left. Mission failed. All friendlies have been neutralized. Sorry, left. Sen, saan na? Ah, close na pala. Sen, saan na left. Sorry, po. And everyone's like, what is the disgusting True. scum on the off. coffee now? And, he, <laughs> and he's like, no, it's natural coffee cream. Right. Natural coffee okay. cream. Uh, 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 which is a, a beautiful piece yeah. of marketing that, that has, uh, right. I think, transported espresso's kind of uh, brand around the world. Yeah. What we're going to do, what we used to do, was get a spoonful and slurp very loudly from the spoon, yeah. aerate the coffee in the mouth, yeah. and, and sort of turn up the volume. Um, but then what we would do is kind of give it a quick rinse in hot water and put that same spoon that had been in our mouths back in another bowl. Oh, let's would... not do that. Yeah. Right, so okay. that's not yeah. what we do anymore. So yeah. that's why you have a little cup. And what we'll do is take a spoonful, throw it in the little cup. Yep. Uh, and then slurp as, as, yep. as rudely as you'd like. <laughs> All right. From so the little cup. All I want you to do as you taste through these is compare the bitterness of one to the bitterness of two, the bitterness of two to the bitterness of three. Right, and ignore everything else. Ignore everything else right okay. now. I just want you to focus on bitterness to start okay. with. Take your time. Don't right. feel rushed by me in any way. Spoonful. Spoonful into the cup. Into the cup. A little swirl, cool it down a touch and make swirl. it easier. Cool it down a touch. I'll have another little go on this. All right. And then uh, have a sip. Now your brain's going to be like, uh, you've got no benchmark yet. So no, I don't. Have a sip. Think about the bitterness. Hmm. Okay. And then... I mean, already compared to, you know, 14-year-old me spitting this out immediately and going, like, clearly my palate has changed because... That's not... You're not upset? That's not unpleasant. It's not... Oh, I know. Tara, emerald na lang. Emerald things tayo mag-alerald, Arts. Oo, oh, emeralds na lang. Uy, stage yung bravo. <laughs> yeah. Pleasant yet, because I haven't got used to it. Yeah. But it's a... Yeah, that's that's a thing. Alright. Number two. So, it's a bit oh, that's, that's less... Bitter, I think, or is it just warmer? 
no, it's less bitter. Okay. Oh, what the heck? Yeah. Oh, that's it. It's, there is a, uh, there is a less bitter than two in one. Uh, go. No, that's almost. My brain almost briefly thought that was sweet. That's well, we'll think about sweetness in a second. Mm. Have a compare. So yeah. benchmark that bitterness in your brain. Yeah. Number three. Number three. <clears throat> Swirl it round. Let it cool down a moment. Now, I don't know whether my taste buds have just been blown out by those first two, but that barely tastes bitter at all to me. It is pretty, pretty barely it's bitter. Yeah. Right. Yes. And people have an expectation of coffee's flavor, that it, it is this big, right. harsh, mean mm. thing. And so most people reach for milk or they reach for sugar because they want to temper that bitterness. And milk, right. is, milk is an amazing thing. It's one of the few natural right. bitter coffees out there. Most coffee needs milk and sugar. Right, most okay. coffee that you will drink in the world, yes. I would recommend <laughs> tempering it because most coffee isn't very good compared to how good coffee can be. Right. Now, you said sweetness, so let's go the other way again. So okay. let's go three, two, one, yes. sweetness comparison. Right. Okay. How does the sweetness of one, uh, sorry, three compared to the sweetness of two? Okay, right. So focus right. on that. And the spoon does not touch the cup. There is, there is an air gap there. That's it. Let's go still a little bit for me. Oh, spot, spot the person who used to do computer security, mm -hmm. air gap. Right, uh, so we'll look at the sweetness. I don't know what that means because I watch Mr. Robot. Oi, but the night night. I want to go go on out. Put it. Let them come. You and you know. Swapping mugs. A shotgun, yeah. Oh, sir. Kaya nga, sharp yung nagagamitin yun. Pinigay yung shotgun ni Ali, bay. 10 seconds remaining. Yung bay. Device placed. Bomb location secure. Device. Wait lang, lad. Easy lang. And then, lad. And then, lad. So, go, mas lang. Yan? Ah, four has located a bomb. You know what to do. Babago on the ebotas. Parang papasok na sila. Butas na. True. Paano nabasag yung kuryente? Ano? Yung Rotero boy? Send it. My bad. Okay, oh, I'm gonna put the animal. Parang sarap magtok ang dami ng buway yah. Now sweetness is a tricky word, right? Gawing ko naman. Gaya ko naman na magwarden na. Uh -oh. Right, because mm. you will have coffees that taste sweet, but do not taste sweetened. 
Right, yes. so the moment that I added a sprinkle of sugar to, to that, you'd be like, oh no, that's sweetened. Bit. Yeah, that's... And instead, you're looking for a kind of pleasant characteristic, a kind of natural sweetness, but not a sugary sweetness. Right, and I feel like there's a bit of that in there. But I'm being very uh, non-committal on that. Just Ten seconds to insertion. Reloading. Five seconds of counting. Oh, Found a bomb. You must have been able to get the bomb. I'm going to get the bomb. I'm going to get the bomb. I'm going to get Grab in the man. Charge! Put him on a little show. Oh, yes. Reloading. He para plus fifty. Dito, pini ko dito pa pas. Come here, come here, come. Yeah. Kira lang ko to eh. Dito ko ba siya kung sa'yo lunch. Ikot, tayo na nyo ba dito? Sige. Putang inam. Ha? Doon pa rin. Piso, piso. Ooh, grab it, man. <laughs> Just to, uh, yeah, that looks on, don't know what to compare it to. All right, number two. <laughs> it's hard to taste above the bitter note there. Well, as I take yourself back then to the first thing you tasted that you were surprised I'll by. Yeah. How, how does that now stack up? Now that you've got I a feel like there's a sweet, no a sweet note in there, but I only got on like the last. I'm, I, I'm second guessing myself here. I feel like there was a sweet note in there towards the end when it was starting to get cooler. All right, let's do number one. So this was bitter, or so. This was the most bitter of the three. So does it also have that sweet note in it? So I don't think it does. I don't think it does Uy, grabe naman. Parang benta. Oh, 
save. Well reinforced. What the panic there? Sabi nga nila, don't panic, it's organic. Puta, mayroong tao sa baba. Oh my god. Ulo. Ho? Huh? Parang ka-report report ka. Uy, puta. Bakit ah! okay, okay, archives? Okay. One on window. One on window. Zero on, Zero window. on window. Side window. Side window. Parang cheater yung bak... Penetrace yung ulo ko. Up, interrogation. You're on my so miserable. Huh? Oh, you know. Okay, that's, that's I keep us like I feel like I'm guessing. I feel like an imposter here who is magically guessing the correct things because I don't know if I were to rate them. I'm well, not uh, sure about these two. That well, one's definitely uh, not got a sweet note here. I feel like two I might have had one. more of that. Ooh, but I'm not one. sure about that choice. I, I think they're pretty close in terms of sweetness. I, th I think... Um, I feel like... Mm, yes, yes, yes. The opticians and somebody's got one... Yung ano... Yung damage to use your drone to locate a bomb. 135 na. So... Hindi, dati, ano... Pag 3 armor, yung matitira pa konti. Ngayon, pag... Kahit 3 armor, 100... Oh, ano na. Pag sa katawan. Drone has located a bomb. Seconds to insertion. Five seconds. Proceed to bomb location and defuse it. Talunan agad yan. Go, go, go. Wait long. Wait long. Go. Putang ina, ang bagal mag-ADS! I absolutely mind that we finished off that, but you know, I, I, there was Oi. more in the cabin, I just kind of sit. That was really <laughs> pleasant. Well, that's it. We're, 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 we're gonna go one more <laughs> the yeah, sort of characteristic at this stage, right? Okay. Which is, I want you to pay attention to acidity just quickly. Well, just taste yeah, each yeah. one, uh, and tell me which one you feel has the most acidity to it. Alright. Bagal mag-ADS, putang ina. Sa acid ako eh, Bishop, okay. pag ano, pag tumawag siya, tas kahit patay ka na, no, ma-affect ako pa rin dito mga pag-drums. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. Pero di mahak. Spiral stairs. Oh, 
Oh, Tai. Kapit. Kabira pa naman. Oh. Oh, puto. Iiwasan yung bala, sir. Matindi. Matindi itong bata akong to. What? Lagi 2v2 pa? Okay na sir, winnable pa yan Kaid on site Scanning for electronics Tumagalaw si Pals, nakikita si Pals The diffuser is no longer in your possession down to one friendly. Oh, you know. eliminated all friendly. Oh. Definitely more in two than one. Because I know what I'm looking oh, for so here. More yeah. than anything else, like, I know what flavor I'm trying, what, what profile I'm trying to match in my head there. Three. Yeah. But only, uh, two definitely has some. Mm -hmm. But I feel like three definitely has. Pero sama sama tayo. Sa tunnel, sa tunnel, sa salami. Pwede tayo mag-tunnels. Kasi pa ang... Gipit. May ipit tunnels tayo dun eh. Oo nga. Sige, labi na lang. Labi, labi. labi. More of that sort of vinegar citrus bite to it. Do you like it? Guri yes. Natin sila. And so... Para di tayo maka... I, I would say, uh, I would infer then that this is probably your preference of these three yes. from a sort of taste's perspective. It's got a hint of sweetness to it. Mm -hmm. Ano ba sa... May... May tao ah, sa lab. Si Ryan Ronnie Jakes. Mm -hmm. They were then. Ten seconds. Rush in at then. Yes, sir. Is there maybe an lobby? No, what's the lobby? A bomb must be located and defused. I think I go in six. Located a bomb. Two F, two F. Boy, boy, boy. Come on, come on, socks are on. Uh huh. Uh huh. Droning all up. Bomb has been located. And less bitterness, but it's also got that acid bite. Right, so from this, yep. I now have a good benchmark of kind of what you're right. into. What yep. we're going to do now is refine that through another round of tasting. Okay. Love mixing flavors? Try the new Lucky Me Pancit Canton Mix and Match! Mixed ang flavors! Round two is no longer about sort of taste. So the first round was really about, you know, bitter, sweet, acidity. Um, how do you feel about those? How do you perceive those? How do you enjoy those? Right. Here we're going to focus much more on flavor, which okay. is a little bit more challenging because then you're into sort of finding the words and the wine tasting and the hints of wisteria or all of that. <laughs> Uh, sort of stuff. Don't worry too much about that. We'll, we'll pick it apart a little bit more in a second. But that's what we're going to do. So uh, if you want to have a little smell, again, right. just compare and contrast. Number one. Um, see how you feel. Hmm. I <laughs> don't have the words. You're right. No, it's okay. I'll give you some words later and they'll be hopefully satisfying. I don't want to say floral. Floral is the wrong. Oh, eh? But plants. Oh, yes. the case. Which is an obvious thing. It's coffee. Oh, it's a plant. That's not a helpful word, but. Oh, I need. I need to go down to the Okay. Ayo! Ayo! 
Puta, ito pa! Galawa pa stood pa rin! They're all in, all in, all Oh. Nice, nice try, bro. Oh, oh, what's that? That is, that's a memory from something. I almost want to say berries. Mm -hmm. I don't know what berry, but that's the Ali access. Se recto ba tayo site o magkisayagin? Direct site? Wala ako problema dyan. Ah, sige, sige. The note? You're saying, mm -hmm, I can't talk uh, about uh, that. Thinking I'm mad. Locate a bomb. Hi, guys. Oh, you're being in the bus, no Arthur. You want the on drone? Ten seconds. Spawn pick yung L You found a bomb, make your way to its location Spawn pick sa ano May obvious Ano yun? Archive sila, di ba? Oh. Nandito ako. May Ella sa ano, reception area. Bomb detected. Hindi pa. Reception area yung Ella. Hey, blue. Di ba? Tara, pasok. Di ako makapasok, guard. Uy, meron na! Nasa tethers. Ayun, ayun, ayun! Bago! Bulag na bulag siya! Mataas pa yung kumay sir! Tumusurrender na yung tao eh! Ayaw ni! Nice pick eh! Hindi ko rin alam eh! Nag-flash ako eh! Ewan ko sa akin! Ayaw ba kay George? Tumusurrender na sir! Ayaw ko na! Tira! Civilian! Oh, he didn't get it. Or thinking that I can't, I can't skew you too far one way or the other. Oh, um, spice. Specifically, uh, almost like the the vinegary thing you get from kimchi or something like that. 
A kind of fermented note. Yes, yes, that's the word, fermented. All right. You you are scoring big points. Am I? You're scoring okay. big points. I'm going to get a kettle. You're okay. scoring. You're doing very well. <laughs> yes, bro. Yes, bro. Be advised, your drone has located a bomb. This is Ten seconds to go. Meron na kong ibang tongers dito. Hindi na ano. Hindi na amaro. Proceed to bomb location. Bomb ground out to the team. Si ano na, team ka baby. Spawn pick ba? Sa site, hindi. Sa site pa yun? Nag-window ako yun. Ha? Paano hindi namatay yun? Puto! Natural outlet. Ano walang papasukan yan? Tulad nyo! Ayan, nakapasok. Ano, paano hindi naman tayo yung alibay? Buha na ako ilang buhay. Walang tao sa reception, sa front desk. Hanggang sa may ano lang siya ko Toby! Yeah. Oh, tangin na. Battle eye. Kampi natin na battle eye. Talaga? Loading magic! Down to one friendly. The diffuser is no longer in your possession. Op 4 eliminated all friendly. Uh, GG eh. I found a skill. <laughs> this is good. So far, doing things where I'm outside my comfort zone, I haven't found skills. And now, yeah, yeah, your your coffee tasting language is very good. Okay. Right. Flavor. Right. It's hard. Yes. And that's okay. Right. Okay. So don't don't. Hmm. Kasi lumatay nun. beat yourself up yeah, about those kind of things. Man, so you start initially, do that kind of initial area. Keep the bombs protected. Device placed. Ba, sira din yung hatch din sa amin. Sira pa. Device set. Bomb locations are secure. Device activated. Ba, may shotgun ka ba ba? Orange box. Hindi, hindi, hindi. A bomb has been located by Op 4. Gabo, may tao na sa ano? White stairs.
Hmm, tak ada mu. Mag check. Eh, nanti kita gulat aku. Ako na Cover me reloading Merong garage One here, one here Uh, pasok at nung pasok ng garage. Stairs, stairs, right stairs. Sige ako sa pa pasok ng garage. Reloading mag. One out four remaining. Ito na lang atas namin. Right stairs yun na. Down to 15 seconds. Time expires in 10 seconds. Get down there. Five seconds. Default. Planting. Op four eliminated. Mission successful. Sa bakatlo, tang ina mo eh. Sa saksi, sa saksi kay mo palib eh. Tang ina mo eh. Patata. Tatalo pa tayo, Lib, eh. <laughs> Panood ko na yun, Lib, eh. Panood ko na yun, eh. Panood ko na yun, Lib. Sa baba sila. Maglabi ba tayo? Pwede naman. Uh, Plus, as Mark said, how does this feel? Sweet as the patient has the facility. Swallow, and then sort of think about what's left filling your head. Right, well, what kind of flavors? Yes, that's the sort of easiest time. No, the one. We're going to roof the bar. Right. Just a quick taste through. Number one, not pleasant for me. Cap kan ya. Ten seconds to insertion. Ina. I D D ya. Five seconds before insertion. Your mission is to locate and defuse a bomb. Yes. So may ATMs. Second turo tayo pumasok boy. Para meron natin. Ito meron. Meron sa YF at ay hindi Dito pa lang ako sa reception Dari yung CEO Ayun po, tang ina nakita na ako So may ano Spiral, spiral po ang front desk Down to one friendly Saan ba yung pumasok? Nagpakalaglag kayo dun? Hmm. 
Pero magagali sa first to. All friendlies have been eliminated. Okay. There's some note in that. I would go with earthy. Not sure it's the right word, but I'm going to go with earthy. It doesn't work for me there. Yeah. And, but but that as a flavor is quite appealing to a number of people. Oh, okay. Okay. Right. So that that is quite. Did you know that? Did you do that?